Hello guys and welcome back to my channel. If you are new to my channel, my name is Langstella and welcome to my channel. Please don't forget to subscribe before you leave. In today's video, I'm going to be talking about my favorite affordable palettes, um, eyeshadow palettes. I don't want to say eyeshadow palettes from the drugstore because they're not from the drugstore, but they are pretty affordable. I consider um, palettes being affordable if they're under 30 if they're under 25 then that's like way better. But if they're under $30, then I, I, I personally consider that affordable. So I will talk to you guys about some that I have that are my favorite ones. I, I don't remember the prices at the top of my head. But I will um, put it on the screen somewhere. And as I do with every product that I mention, I will link everything down on the description box. Just in case you guys are interested in checking the palettes out or buying one. So I'm going to start off with this. Um, palette by Juvia's Place, and this is the Nubian palette. This one right here. It's a little dirty because I do use it a lot. And this is what the inside looks like. I love the shades. They are really pretty. It has, a, it has some mattes and some shimmer ones, and I really love this combination of colors right here. And then um, the next one that I'm going to talk to you guys about, I, to me, I consider it a favorite version of the, of the Nubian. And this one is um, the 35-0 by Morphe. Just this one right here. Because if you guys can see, I'm going to put it, I'm going to, but you guys can compare. It, the shades in here are the same ones uh, that are some in this palette. But I do like both of them. I don't use one more than the other. I use both of them the same. But what I do like about this one is that this one is good for traveling because of the size. And because of the packaging, you, you don't have to worry about it, about the eyeshadow breaking or anything. And this one, the, it has more selections, which is why I like it. And you can use this to do any kind of look, a natural look, a smoky look, just whatever you like and as you can see i've used it a lot the next eyeshadow is another one by morphe and this one is the 35 b palette this one right here when i first started doing makeup i didn't really go for colorful eyeshadows i just uh, stick to neutrals and like browns and shades like that but I, I did get out of my comfort zone and I started doing colorful looks and this is the palette that I use the most for that and I really love this palette just because it has a lot of different colors and that's what I love about this palette and I do use it a lot it has it has mostly mattes but it does have a couple of shimmer color shades in there the next one is from Morphe as well and this one is one of their newer palettes and this one is their um, 15N Night Master Palette. It looks like this. This one is kind of like, um, it has the same shades as the 35 Old Palette. Shows that these plummy shades are not in the 35 Old Palette. Which I really like about this, um, palette. And also because of the size, you can also take this, um, when you travel. And because the packaging is pretty sturdy. I love when palettes have mirrors. And this one has a really big mirror. So you, you know, they have a mirror out there. Yeah, and I have used it all, especially the shimmer eyeshadow. They're just so so pretty. And what I like about Morphe eyeshadows is that they're really um creamy and really blendable, and they are really really easy to to work with. And I love that how they and I love how they are affordable. The last two ones that I'm gonna talk to you guys about are from BH Cosmetics. The first one is the Carly Bible Deluxe Edition Palette. I don't want to tilt it too much because one of the um, eyeshadows is loose. I dropped it and one popped out, but it didn't break anything. But I don't remember which one it was, so I just want to be careful with it. That's what the inside looks like. It has mattes and shimmers, and then these on here are highlighters. And I tend to use these for um, shimmer eyeshadows just because I don't, I don't, I don't like using these um, as highlighters. But I do use these highlighters. They are really, really pretty. And then I love all the shimmer eyeshadows. Um, I do have the first palette, but I can't find it. So that's why I'm showing you this one. But I like both of them. I just like how this one has more selections and it has more highlighters. 
but this one is also a really pretty palette and it also has a mirror which I really really like as well and then the last palette is also from Beach Cosmetics and this one is their Solar Flare um, palette and this is a 18 color baked eyeshadow palette I'm gonna go ahead and take it out of the box so this is what the inside of the palette looks like these are all um baked shimmer eyeshadows and they are so so pretty and they are really really easy to work with and i just love the range of shades it has it has orange colors some purple colors browns uh, a red one and the rest are kind of like between gold gold and bronze colors they're pretty pigmented without wetting the brush but i just wet the brushes because i'm used to it and they get way more pigmented and it looks way way prettier I do have more um, other affordable ones. Those are my top favorite ones. And um, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. I'm going to try to do more videos of these of my favorite affordable and also high-end makeup. But I don't have any drugstore eyeshadow palettes, which I think is weird. Because I have a lot of um, drugstore makeup, but I, don't have, but I don't have drugstore palettes. Which is, I don't know why I do have one. But it's not my favorite one but it's decent but yeah i hope you guys enjoyed this video if you did please don't forget to like share and subscribe and until next time bye guys feeling the sun party done shadows walking home walking with a game